and welcome back to today's yoga class. My name is I Dream of Earth and I'm so excited to bring you our first yoga flow of 2023. Um, this class was designed to help you become more in touch with your feelings and your emotional body. Um, I know for me personally, I have often felt in the past like <clears throat> excuse me like um my feelings would almost like get in the way of things um when they were really erratic super like happy happy and then like down depressed um and i felt like i couldn't i couldn't um i couldn't be myself almost because i had this burden of emotions that i just didn't know what to do with um and the more that we you know, obviously, if we're human, having emotions is part of of the human experience. But the more that we accept our emotions, which is also something that a lot of us haven't, you know, been encouraged to do for most of our life. Think back to childhood when um, maybe you would be really upset having a tantrum, and your parents wouldn't necessarily understand why. And you don't have the ability to communicate beyond that tantrum and so you were silenced and shushed and told you know you're going to get a time out you're being a bad girl you're being a bad boy like you know and or worse who knows and so we've learned to not feel our feelings especially when they're really hard and heavy but suppressing and kind of like cutting ourselves off from those like really intense emotions is not healthy it's not good for us because it's our natural desire to feel the depth of our human experience and when we feel like we can't reach that emotion and we don't know how to process and regulate our emotions we're not feeling like we're necessarily alive and that's not to say that um you know, it's this is only for like bad feelings. You know, when we when we cut off our emotions, um, you know, maybe we're not allowing ourselves to go to the depth of our sadness. That also has the adverse effect, where we're not allowing ourselves to reach the peak of our happiness as well. And so we're kind of living our life with this like everything's okay. You know, it's okay. It's not good. It's not bad. It is what it is, like just like going through the motions. And so the more we breathe into this emotional body and accept whatever comes up, right? So that means that during this flow, if you don't feel anything at all, if you feel a numbness, that's okay too. Accept that. This is going to be a practice of acceptance of the present moment in whatever arises. So Drop any expectations. Let's just shake it out. Shake out any expectations. Shake out any uh, need to be any other way than exactly as you are in this present moment. And this is just like a little bonus tip. Um, in order to decipher like what's truly ours and what is not, right? What it maybe we've absorbed from the people around us consciously or unconsciously. Um, this is, I use this like every morning, it's a selenite wand and what you can do, if you don't have this, that's okay, you can just like use your hands because our hands are also very healing. But the selenite wand, I like to just kind of like drag around my aura and intuitively feel like, oh, where is their tension? And um, Kind of like breathe into the space around you and again use your hands if you don't have a wand available you can definitely just pick this up like if you google selenite wand um you can find one very easily or if there's like a metaphysical shop or a crystal shop around you they'll definitely have one um and this is really good for just kind of like letting go of other energies that's not yours you know and kind of like cleansing the aura, coming back to that space of self. Okay. And if you want to pause this and go deeper into your own aura cleansing, 
please go ahead and do so. Otherwise, we're gonna start in child pose. You can do uh, wide-legged or knees together, whatever feels best for you. I'm just kind of like, your body. Settle into the breath. Start by breathing in through the nose and out the mouth to really regulate your nervous system. Nice, big, deep, cleansing breath. yourself to come into the present moment. And breathe out when you have a thought, just exhale, let it go. Without needing to spiral into the thought. Just kind of label it as I'm thinking right now. I don't need to be thinking right now. The only thing I need to be doing is feeling in my body. And slowly, 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 press into your palms. Allow your body to rise. Maybe bring your knees together. And just start circling your shoulders. Nice, big, deep breaths. Going back and forwards. Feeling in your body. Any spaces of tension. Maybe get your neck a little involved. Pushing down on your palms, taking some nice, big, deep breaths. Not pushing yourself past your limits. Feeling into your body when enough is enough. Not needing anything to look any away. This is a practice of feeling and being with yourself right here, right now. One more nice big breath in. And we're gonna switch our breathing to in through the nose, not out through the nose. To contain the energy, slowly, slowly, slowly rise. Spiral the toes towards and opening up your shoulders. Breathing in and breathing out. And start to swivel. <laughs> swivel. Breathing. Inhale. And exhale. Activating Mula Bandha. Squeezing your lower body more deeply contain your energy. Now we're gonna do this a little more precise. So we're gonna inhale to the left and to exhale to the right. Still squeezing your lower body nice and tight. Containing the energy, keep breathing. And 
come through center, hold, pause, inhale, both arms all the way up, big breath in, 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 hold, squeeze. Feel the breath rise to your crown, squeezing your low body, relax your shoulders, keep breathing in, 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 in. Hold. Hold, squeeze, hold, squeeze. And then exhale slowly. Release downward facing dog. Tucking your toes. Pushing back and up. Nice and slow. And just feeling into your body. And breathing. Maybe shake your head up. Continuing to contain your energy, Mula Bandha. Breathing in through the nose and out the nose. Perfect. Now we're going to lift this. And exhale, come down, down, down to your knees. Lower your elbows, bringing your chest and chin to the ground. Booty still up in the air. And slowly inhale as you come forwards. Maybe baby cobra, maybe king cobra, whatever feels right for you. And Listening to the sound of your breath. Let you breathe in. And breathe out. And exhale. We'll come back. Child pose. This time, do the opposite of what you did before. Bring your hands back behind you. Again, listen to the sounds of your breath your body naturally breathing and see if you can tune into the feeling of the breath within you. you can. Can you label that feeling? And if you can't, can you accept yourself exactly as you are? Knowing we are always growing and deepening our awareness. Maybe with this acceptance, you notice your body wanting to relax even more. Allowing your fingertips to soften, your heart to ground closer to the earth, to Goddess Gaia. And maybe, just maybe, you can feel your heart beating in your chest, your body breathing, your heart beating, you 
functions, automatic and essential functions of life. Breathe, relax, feel, observe. yourself to tune into these vital signs of life always occurring within you and around you. And take one more nice big breath here. Inhale. And exhale slowly as you can, starting with your fingertips and your hands, your elbows. Bringing your hands underneath your shoulders and very, very slowly bringing yourself be the last to rise. Arms lift up overhead. And exhale. Hands coming down. Send some loving, healing vibes to Goddess Gaia. Breathing in that love, those good feelings that we've cultivated. And exhale, sending them down, down, down through our heart, through our arms, through our hands, through the floors, the mat, the soil, reaching the core of Goddess Gaia, allowing her to fill up with our love, our gratitude. Mm, exhale, coming back up, down, down. Hands lift all the way up to the sky. And then this time we'll exhale. Hands come down, down, down. Placing our palms on our heart to send love and healing vibes to ourselves. Thanking ourselves for showing up today in all of our feelings, accepting all of our feelings, all of our emotions, and um, trusting, allowing the trust. in our heart, within our breath, that natural intelligence. To reverberate throughout our entire being, our entire life. Maybe place your hands on your head, reminding your mind How much your body does automatically without needing to think about it or journal about it or write about it or complain about it or blah blah whatever the human does every day we don't need to remind ourselves to breathe. We don't need to remind ourselves our heart to beat. And yet our body does it. And so let's tap into, let's set 
the intention to continue tapping into that wisdom of the higher intelligence of our body so that when we come into a space of feeling of intense emotions we automatically remind ourselves to breathe we remind ourselves and good thank you so much for sharing this experience with me i um, would love to hear your thoughts and um, how this made you feel anything that it brought up um, always yeah i'm always uh always here so sending lots of love and blessings your way namaste